Hey guys, Fatigue here, and welcome back to part two of the Oblivion main quest line. Let's play. All right, wrong button. So we are gonna fast travel here to the Wainin Priory to speak with Joffrey and deliver him the Amulet of Kings and see his, I'm sure, priceless reaction. Yes, I'd like to travel to the Wainin Priory. Oh, so enchanting and spell making can only be performed by Mages Guild members. I thought I thought anyone could like learn that stuff in the Mages Guild, but I guess not. Let's take the amulet to Joffrey. I bet you Joffrey is right through these doors. All right. Where is he? Up? Oh, not up this way. Jump. Hello. I'm Brother Joffrey. What do you want? Your brains. This cannot be. No one but the Emperor is permitted to handle the amulet. Let me see it. All right, douchebag. Here you By go. the nine. This is the amulet of kings. I told you. Who are you? How did you get this? What do you know of the Emperor's death? As unlikely as your story sounds, I believe you. Only the strange destiny of Uriel Septim could have brought you to me carrying the Amulet of Kings. His meaning is unclear to me as well. The Emperor seemed to perceive some threat from the demonic world of Oblivion. Interesting. The Prince of Destruction, Merun's Dagon, is one of the Lords of Oblivion. But the mortal world is protected from the Daedra of Oblivion by magical barriers. I'm not sure. Only the Emperors truly understand the meaning behind the rituals of coronation. And the Emperor is dead. The Amulet of Kings is ancient. Saint Alicia herself received it from the gods. It is a holy relic of great power. When an Emperor is crowned, he uses the Amulet to light the dragon fires at the Temple of the One in the Imperial City. With the Emperor dead and no new heir crowned, the dragon fires in the Temple will be dark for the first time in centuries. It may be that the dragon fires protected us from a threat that only the Emperor was aware of. Ah. I am one of the few who know of his existence. Many years ago, I served as captain of Uriel's bodyguards, the Blades. One night, Uriel called me into his private chambers. A baby boy lay sleeping in a basket. Uriel told me to deliver him somewhere safe. He never told me anything else about the baby, but I knew it was his son. From time to time, he would ask about the child's progress. Now, it seems that this illegitimate son is the heir to the Septim throne, if he yet lives. His name is Martin. He serves Akatosh in the chapel in the city of Kvach, south of here. You must go to Kvach and find him at once. If the enemy is aware of his existence, as seems likely, he is in terrible danger. And please, let me know if there's anything you need. My resources here are limited, but I will help in any way I can. Thank you, sir. I keep a few things here in my chest to resupply traveling blades. Great. Right, we can probably uh, unequip this torch now. Think so? I think so. Oh, he's gonna open it for me. Cool. Ah! Two-hand blade, though. Oh. Nice. Take all your potions. That should be efficient. And take off the shackles. Because we're not a prisoner anymore. Now we're like, um, helping the king. That blue hair is awesome. All right, so we're going to have to go outside and fast travel. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Kvach. Kvach, 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 Kvach. Leowin. Kvach. Isn't Kvach like up here? Ah, Bruma. Skingrad. Oh, it, right. It's like all the way. There it is. There we go. Kvach, yes.
All oh, right, this is where everyone's panicking and stuff. Of Come course. on, run while there's still time. The guard still holds the road, but it's only a matter of time before they're overwhelmed. Overwhelmed of what? God's blood. You don't know, do you? <laughs> Deidre like overran Kvach last night. There were glowing portals outside the walls, gates to oblivion itself. There was a huge creature, something out of a nightmare. Came right over the walls. All right, that's pretty badass. That you know, you gotta admit, dude. Swarmed around it, killing. Go and see for yourself. Kvach is a smoking ruin. We're all that's left. Do you understand me? Everyone else <laughs> is dead. I like this guy. It was Savly and Matthias. Some of the other guards helped some of us escape. They cut their way out right through the city gates. Savly and says they can hold the road. No, no, I don't believe him. Nothing can stop them. If you'd seen it, you'd know. I'm getting out of here before it's too late. They'll be here any minute, I'm telling you. Run when you can. No, that's such a nice sunset, too. Unfortunately, at the scene of terror. Let us journey on to danger. What do you have to say Hope about this? Is gone. The, the covenant is Ah, no. Leave me alone. It'll be alright. I think. Climbing up the mountain road to Kavach. Going to see the city in destruction. Probably gonna have to close and oblivion gate. Ba dum bum ba ba dum. If you guys get the dum dum ba dum ba ba dum ba ba dum reference, you're awesome. Yeah, see, ah, I remember this. The sky gets all badass when you're, when you're near an oblivion gate. And then the spikes are coming out of the ground and shit. Oh man. Yeah, here we go now. Alright, it'd probably be a good idea to wield a sword right about now. Look at that thing! That is awesome and totally not related to the Lord of the Rings whatsoever. What are you guys doing? Hey. Hey. What are you guys to fire at me for? Oh, I don't have my range attack on. That would do it. Hey. Someone here. You. Talk to me. Someone. Where are you? Should I go into the gate? Hey. Stand back. This is no place for you. Get back to the encampment at once. You got like a blade coming out of your neck, dude. We lost the damn city. That's what happened. Oh well, cool down, dude. Too douchebag. much. Too fast. We were overwhelmed. Couldn't even get everyone out. There are still people trapped in there. Some made it to the chapel, but others were just run down in the streets. The count and his men are still holed up in the castle, and now we can't even get back into the city to help them. Damned oblivion gate blocking the way. What are you implying? The only thing we can do. We'll try to hold our ground. That's what. If we can't hold this barricade, those beasts could march right down and overrun the encampment. Well, duh. There's only I three have to of you. I try and protect the few civilians that are left. It's all I can do now. Or get that blade out of your neck. You want to help? You're kidding, right? Yeah, sure. Hmm. If you're serious, maybe I can put you to use. Are you sure? I don't know how to close this gate, but it must be possible because the enemy closed the ones they opened during the initial attack. You can see the marks on the ground where they were, with the great gate right in the middle. I sent men into the gate to see if they could find a way to shut it. All right. I, come back. I guess we're going into the if gate. You can get in there. Find out what happened to them. If they're alive, help them finish the job. If not, the best I can say is good luck. If you make it back alive, we'll be waiting. Good luck. Well, all right, right now we can do one of two things. We can go in here and go into Kvach, or take the more badass route and close the gate. I say we close the gate. And also, you guys think right now, Ooh, Fatica, you said it'd only be the main quest line, yada, yada, yada. Technically, this is the main quest line. 
So let's go. Now, I remember... Oh, Jesus. Oh, these things... This is not gonna be fun. I... Oh, yeah, these guys probably are strong against fire. So if I frost touch them, they should be a little bit more damage. Alright, this is gonna be a little bit hard. A lot harder than I thought it would be. You, talk. Speak. Speak. Speak! Dude. Where are you going? Thank the nine. I never thought I'd see another friendly face. You look pretty terrified. The others, taken. They were taken to the tower. Captain Mattias sent us in to try and close the gate. We were ambushed, trapped. I managed to escape, but the others are strewn across that bridge. They took many and off to the big tower. You've got this. I'm getting. All right. Yeah, don't be a You're bitch. Right. I can't just leave poor many into his fate. If he's still alive, got to. All right, lead the way. Let's do it. Now, can we go up and walk through that bridge? Probably not. All right, let's go. Going to close the oblivion gate. I should probably make it my active quest, though. That would probably be a good idea, don't you think? Now, you, now you guys are gonna have to bear with me a little bit here because I always get lost in these things. So, yeah. I mean, like it happens. So, now, unfortunately, these guys are clearly gonna be strong against fire. Let's see if I have a shocking touch protect. Yeah, I don't have I don't have a ranged attack besides flare, I don't think. So Um Yep, we're just gonna continue. Don't feel like hot keying any of those right now. Let's go. Get back here, we go. Oh, jeez. Yo, dude. Yeah, there we go. Help me out, dude. Come on. Oh, shocking touch. That one. That one owns. Alright, so since this is the first gate, it shouldn't be, you know, that hard to close, right? I mean, it should be. It should be pretty alright. Oh, jeez. These things are... Dude, don't attack the plants. Don't, don't be stupid. Ah, yes, we are approaching the tower. See, I thought I thought they wouldn't make this one too complicated. Thought about it, you know? Yeah, you know. Oh, you shot me. Oh, dodged that. What now, huh? Oh, that's what now. Oh, yeah, you just got shocked, dude. What are you gonna do now? Get shocked again. There's the tower we gotta get up. Alright. Alright. It's not fair that their flares are like a guided freaking missile, you know? Are you serious? All right, screw him. We're going in. Oh, there he is. Nice of you to show up, dude. Uh, I remember this game now. Oh, what the fun it is. Oh, dude, this is the same thing we fought outside, man. Things will get worse if we go up. Cool. Oh, th this dude's about to die. Wish there's something I could do, dude, but quite honestly, I really don't care.
I mean, that would be the ideal plan. Oh, he... He's, he's gonna die. Trailer, that dude's gonna die. Oh, yep, just did. Oh, wow. Alright, you can cast spells too, I see. Oh, dude, this guy's owning me. Alright, let's see. I, pro I, I know I need that for something. Just gonna keep that on hand. Alright, what do you got? Ooh, chainmail. Hmm. I don't want your Kavach curates. I, I always feel so bad when I like loot the allies. It's like, oh, <laughs> that looks pretty rad, right? The blue hair just makes it, though, you know. Oh yeah, blood fountain. That's right. Now I gotta go through one of these. Door to the blood feast. Here and kill this guy. Now, can I use flare against this guy? Nice. Yeah, but it doesn't do much. Oh, this guy doesn't like ice. He does. Oh, you can restore health with these things. Coolio. Shoot, looks like attack. Trying to attack me. The dark corridor of salvation. Here, you gotta say, I mean, I've said this this whole gate, the gates, dude, badass. Oh, hey, how are you? You guys, you guys don't like frost. All this time I was using shock on you, you guys just don't like that. Boom, you're dead. Nothing you can do about it. Was he, like, trying to sniff me out? Oh, can't block that. Then we gotta go back across the plane to oblivion, back into the other tower. Now, if you jump off of that, you're screwed. Then don't do that. I don't wanna do that, even to be funny. That would just be annoying as hell. Over here! Quickly! Oh, hey. Is that you? I sure hope I sure hope that's not the guy we're supposed to be rescuing. Oh, there he is. Hey, how you Over doing? Here. Oh, you're Quickly. you're being blocked by this guy. But this guy doesn't like frost magic, so he's gonna die anyway. Quickly, quickly! There's no time. Oh, dude, you're naked. You must get to the top of the large tower, the sigil key they call it. That's what keeps the oblivion gate open. Find the sigil stone, remove it, and the gate will close. Hurry! The keeper has the key. You must get the key. Okie dokie. Oh, there it is. I have the key. Use the sigil stone. Okay, can I, like, open you? Alright, I guess not. Sorry, dude. Where am, where, where am I going? Oh, now I gotta leave and go back. Oh, God damn. So I have to go back across. Man, that dude is just an inconvenience to everyone, man. I'm back into here. Then go up and close the gate. Okay. I like I like the compass they have. That helps a lot. Just the the, the thing that creeps me out though. Oh jeez, see those creepy sound. Oh, that is someone. I, I thought those were just sound effects. Jeez. Is this a door? This is a door. This is a door. Open with the sigil keep key. Great. Ah, yes. Up here. Have to restore some health a little bit. Put that back on. Ah, yes, here we are. I have to kill someone up here. And then we win the gate.
Take it back up. Oh, hey, how you doing? How are you? I'm good. Oh, man. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. You don't like Frost, do you? Oh, maybe you do. My willpower is being drained my ass. Now, oh, what do I do? I totally forget. Alright, I do have Venom going there. Oh, god damn. Yo, not cool. Not cool, yo. Not cool. I better not die. God, if I die, I'll be pissed. I'll be really pissed off if I die. I don't want to die. I knew I was too low level for this. Well, yeah, well, I mean, Obl Oblivion is smart and scales to your level anyway. So you can't just raffle stomp over anything, no matter how high of a level you are, but, you know... Open with the Sigil Keep key. Let's go through this gate already. Oh, yes, one of these fountains. Boom, restore that health. His eye closed shut. Living gate, but I know I gotta kill a few more things before I do it. I'm not that naive. Oh, right, you gotta go all the way up. Oh, this guy wants them again. Dude, I'm the, I could be the only one. Oh, man, there's three of them, dude. That ain't cool, man. That ain't cool, dude. And this guy's, like, heavily armored and stuff. Come on. Yeah. All right. Climbing up. Well, clearly my whole keep the episodes 20 minutes or under is clearly going to go a little bit out the window on this one. And probably will on more Oblivion Gates. Because if we enter Oblivion Gate... I'm going to try to keep the general rule of you go into Oblivion Gate, you go out of an Oblivion Gate in the same episode. Activate the stone and we win! Right? Yes! There we go, the first Oblivion Gate of the main questline playthrough. How about that, huh? How about them apples? Yes, look at that. That is wonderful. Now let's go tell this guy. So, this is going to mark the end to our episode after we talk to this guy. So, thanks for watching here, guys. Please leave your feedback in the comments section and like the video if you enjoyed it. Alive. You're not the right person. Close the gate. I knew you could do it. I need you to come with us. You've got far more combat experience than me. Are you able to join us now? I can wait, but not for long. We've got to... Not ready yet, because that's the end of the episode, so... The smaller our window of opportunity. Get ready, and do it quickly. We've got to move soon. Alright, so... Are let me just ready? ask him a question. We need to move out soon. You mean the priest? If he's lucky, he's trapped in there. Alright, so... Be quick about it. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, I will see you guys later.